everyone! Today's video is a deep glute stretch. Something to get deep into those hips, right into those glutes, get rid of any tension or soreness so you can feel great. So, let's get to it. We're gonna start today seated on our mats. Let's take a nice inhale, reach the arms forward. Exhale, slowly roll down that spine onto the mat. Beautiful. Now, bringing our knees into our chest, I want us to take a big hug here. Big, deep, slow breaths. A beautiful hug, sending yourself some love. Starting to have positive thoughts into your mind. Allowing your mind to enjoy this moment. Allowing your body to really enjoy this moment. Now we're gonna bring our knees to the center and on an exhale, twist. Don't let the knees touch the ground, but just slowly warm up your back and your body. Inhale, have your knees to the center. Exhale, gentle twist to the left. You could bring your head to the opposite side as well. Exhale to the right. Inhale, center. Now taking those knees, your knees are going to stay together and you're gonna gently press your spine into the ground doing circles. Really massage your back into the mat, massage your kidneys into the floor. Release any pressure that builds up in the lower spine. Reverse that circle, bringing your knees to the left. Also warming up those hips. Great stretch to do in the morning or at nighttime. Bring those feet to the sky, turn out the legs, grab your big toes, happy baby pose. Let's start opening up those hips, rock side to side and breathe. Still feeling that back into the floor, wonderful. Let's come up onto our elbows and we're gonna gently rotate our right leg outwards for four. Warming up that right hip and then bringing it around the other way. So reverse that circle. This movement can be very small. Just building some heat. Let's go to the left leg. Four. And now reverse that circle. Bring the hip up in, down, and keep breathing here. Make sure the hips are really warm before we start to stretch them out. Let's stretch our right leg and do a similar hip rotating circle. Four outside and four circles going towards the inside. Great, let's go to the left leg, stretch that leg, stretch those toes. Four, going outwards. Feel your core here. Four, going inwards. Breathe. Great job. Coming up, inhale, exhale, slowly roll your spine onto the mat. And let's take rolling like a little ball. Tuck in your chin like a little egg and you're just gonna roll. Roll your spine into the mat. Feel your core warming up. And now hold into a boat posture. Feet off the ground, shoulders down, and hold that core. Beautiful, crossing those legs. Bring those arms up. Inhale, exhale, reach forward, just stretch. Allow your head and neck to release. And breathe. I feel a gentle stretch in your hips already. And just allow your muscles to let go. Slowly coming back to seated. Let's bring ourselves onto our hands and knees in all fours and step into our plank position. Big straight line from your toes all the way to your head and slowly press back into that downward facing dog. Let's walk out our dog, bending one knee and then the other knee. Start to get a stretch into those calves. 
Now let's take baby steps towards our hands, forward fold. Gentle bend in the knees because this is our first big stretch. You can stretch one knee and the other. Inhale, let's go halfway up. Exhale, release the head and roll up to standing. Inhale, arms to the sky. And exhale, bring our hands to heart and breathe here. Inhale, arms up to the sky. Reach a little bit back in your back bend. Exhale, forward fold. Release the neck. Inhale, halfway up. Flatten your back. Exhale, release. Let's step into our plank position. Feel your core. And release Chaturanga Dandasana. Inhale, upward facing dog. Shoulders down. Exhale, downward facing dog. Look up to your belly button to release that neck. Feel free to bend your knees. When you're ready, take baby steps to your hands. Forward fold. Inhale halfway. Exhale, release. Bend the knees, roll up to standing. Building heat in our body before we get stretching. Inhale, arms up. Exhale, hands to heart. Beautiful flow. Breathe here. Pushing the palms of your hands together and release your hands. Now, we're going to bring our hands into prayer and lift our right knee up to our chest. Having a right angle with that right knee and placing our foot onto the side of our thigh. Into your tree pose. Find an arm position that feels good for you. I like to hold my arms to the side, bent to 90 degree angles like a tree. You can keep your arms up, keep your hands in prayer, and just breathe. Find the stillness in your mind. Find this inner connection with your body. You are so focused. You are so connected to your body. Now, bringing that leg over to the knee, you're going to slightly bend forward and feel a stretch into your right glute, deep into your right glute. And as you bend forward, keep this balance here. Breathe into your hips, breathe into this discomfort and allow the muscle to relax itself naturally. If you want to go a little bit deeper or you're losing your balance, place your fingers or your hands onto the floor. You'll have a bit more stability and a deeper stretch into this hip joint. Breathe into your hip. Let it just release. And then place your toes onto the mat, onto the left side of your right foot. This stretch goes deeper into the hamstring now. Release your back, your neck. Breathe into your legs. And now step that right leg into a high lunge position. Keep your hands on either side of your foot. Just Kind of wiggle around, allow that hip joint to warm up in this deep stretch. You can take baby circles, you can rock forward and backwards. Listen to your body and feel what it needs in this position. And then we're going to rotate opening to the side. And take a bind. Your left arm and your right arm are going to connect around that left leg. Feel free to open your chest, look up to the sky, flex that right foot, breathe into this deep stretch into that left hip joint. Bringing your hands back onto the mat, and we're going to come into a large second position, forward fold. Place your arms between your legs if that feels good in this wide-legged forward fold. Bending from the hips, going deeper into the hamstrings, 
And when you're ready, slowly bend those knees and roll your back up to standing. Inhale, bring those arms up. Exhale, bend both knees with the toes facing outwards. And hold here. Feel the strength in your inner thighs, your quadriceps, and breathe. Stretching the legs, let's come back to the front of our mats. Mountain pose standing. Inhale, arms up to the sky. Exhale, release forward fold. Inhale, bring those hands to your knees. Exhale, release back. Jump or step into plank. Chaturanga Dandasana. Inhale, upward facing dog. And exhale, push into your downward dog. Going deeper into those calves. Breathe into those calves and slowly walk your feet back to your hands into your forward fold. Breathe here into those hamstrings. Inhale, halfway lengthen your back. Exhale, release the neck and slowly roll yourself back up to standing. Inhale, arms up. Exhale, bring your hands into prayer. And get ready for the other side. Left leg, knee to your chest. Roll out that ankle and feel your core. Placing the left foot on the inside of the right thigh. And find stillness and comfort in your tree pose here. Feeling your abs. Feeling your right foot deep into the mat. And breathe. You are a strong tree. Feel the wind in between your arms. And now crossing our left foot over to our right knee and taking a squat on one leg. Feel the stretch going into your right hip, into your right glutes, and breathe into them to give your muscles as much oxygen as possible and to allow them to release naturally. If you want to go deeper, bring your hands onto the mat. Allow your back to fold over this leg. Letting that right glute release. Get all that tension out, all that pain, all those emotions. You're doing great. Step that left foot crossing over your right and feel this go into your hamstring now. Feel your right hamstring stretch as you breathe into it. Releasing that neck. And now placing those hands into the floor, step that left foot back into a high lunge and slowly start to warm up this hip. Give your right hip some warmth and a little bit of movement in this deep stretch. You can take baby circles, rock yourself forward and back. And now we're gonna open to the left side, keeping both hips open wide and taking a bind behind our right leg. So your left hand and right hand are reaching and meeting behind that right leg. Try to open your chest, push your shoulders down, look up to the sky and breathe here. Feel your right hip just loosening and releasing. Now let's bring our hands onto the mat and stretch out our wide-legged forward fold. Bending from the hips, reach those hands in between your legs for a deeper stretch. And if you want to take a variation here, I like to go into a headstand, bending my arms, putting my head onto the floor and lifting my legs up with my core. Feel the sensation of blood rushing into your brain. Your abdominals are working. 
Really put the pressure into your arms so not all the weight is in your head. Open those legs, bring them back into your forward fold and slowly roll yourself back up to standing. Inhale, arms up to the sky, breathe. Exhale, bending into our goddess pose, knees facing out, toes facing out. And hold. Inhale, stretch those legs, step to the front of our mat and take a flow. Inhale, arms up, exhale, bend forward. Inhale, halfway, exhale, release. Step or hop into plank position. Chaturanga Dandasana. Inhale, look up. Exhale, downward dog. Great job. Feel that heat in your body. Breathe into those hamstrings and get ready. Lift that right leg into the air into your splits, bend that right knee and allow your hips to open. Enjoy this opening of your hips and push the weight into your right hand as you try to grab your right foot with your left hand. It's a bit of a tricky one. Feel your abs, find your balance and stretch that leg back up to the sky and come into our pigeon pose. Try to keep your right knee and foot at a 90 degree angle, stretching that left foot back. I like to lift my arms up and cross the palms together and breathe. Feeling the sensation stretching out that right glute. And if you're ready, bring your hands in prayer, bend over that leg and stretch this hip a bit deeper. This pose normally brings out a lot of emotion, a lot of tension. So just be gentle with yourself and give yourself the time to let go. You can bring your head on the mat if that feels good. Just find your calm, your stillness. Find your peace. Even when there is pain and discomfort, you can always find your peace. Let's bring ourselves back up. And now bending that left leg behind you, take your left hand and hook your left foot with your left elbow. You can take a bind here by then grabbing your left hand and your right hand. In a beautiful mermaid pose, breathe here. It's a deep stretch of the thigh, of the hips. When you're ready, release the foot, release the hands. Take one last final breath and then swing that left leg around and bring it on top of your right leg. Hug that left leg, keep your spine straight and tall, and breathe here. Now going deeper into the left glute. Breathe into that left glute. Feel all the pain and emotion and just let it go. Keep breathing. Whenever you're ready, release that leg. Opening that hip now, we're going to bring our right foot onto the floor and stretch this glute a little bit deeper. I like to press my chest to the sky and just allow this hip and glute to open and release. You can flex that left foot if that feels good and breathe into every pose. Amazing job. Now stretching that right leg, but keeping the left leg where it is, 
Inhale, lift your arms up to the sky and exhale, fold over onto that leg. Still getting a stretch in the left glute, but now releasing the back and also going into that right hamstring. We're doing very deep stretches here, so breathe into your muscles, send them love, send them oxygen. Slowly roll your spine back up, releasing the left leg, straighten both legs, lift up to the sky, inhale, exhale, forward fold, seated. Bend from those hips, do not pull your lower back. Release your neck and just relax. These are great poses to do if you've been driving all day. Roll yourself back up and let's transfer into our downward dog again. Stretch out those calves. And get ready to go to the other side. Lift that left leg up into the splits, high in the sky. Bend that left knee, open that hip. Transfer your weight into your left hand, grabbing that left foot with the right hand. Pull that foot towards your butt. When you're ready, release into your splits. Bending the left leg, Step it through into your pigeon pose. Feel free to lift your arms to the sky or keep them on the mat. And breathe into this left glute. If you feel ready, bend forward, go deeper into this glute. You're doing amazing today, sending your body so much love. Release that neck. Breathe into your hips. Slow, calm breaths. And feel that sensation of that muscle releasing little by little. Take all that stress out of your body. Roll yourself back up, bend that right leg, and reach for that right foot with your right elbow. Feel free to bind the arms. Push your head into your left elbow, look up to the sky. Breathe into that right thigh. This is a very advanced and deep stretch. Please be careful and listen to your body. Release that leg, swinging that right leg over on top of your left leg and give that right knee a big hug. You can take a gentle twist here, but just hug that knee to feel the stretch into your right glute. And keep your spine tall. Keep both glute muscles on the floor and hug your knee in towards your chest. Breathe. Let's go deeper into the glute and the hip. Put that left foot onto the floor, opening the right leg and look up to the sky. Push your chest to the sky. You can feel free to rock side to side if that gives you a deep stretch into your glutes. And then stretch that right foot, lift up to the sky and fold over in this position. A forward fold with the right knee bent. Breathe deeply here. 
stretching into that left hamstring. Your lower back is released. Your neck is released. And now we're gonna stretch both legs in front, lift our arms to the sky, and forward fold, sitting down. To release both of those hamstrings. Giving our bodies a moment to relax. Giving our minds a moment to relax. And if you feel ready, sit up, cross those legs, and let's just take a deep breath all together. Inhale, bring those arms up. Exhale, bring your hands in prayer. Rub those wrists together. And thank you so much for joining me. Namaste.